I start with the baby out of my arms so that I can demonstrate to the mum exactly how to hold her hands before I actually have a baby in my hands and I can't show her. So what we do is the baby's head is always going to be towards the light source so I just get the mum to put her hand up like that nice and close to her face and the other one is going to come underneath and up and through. So the head is always going to be the front hand so that the head is closer to the camera than the bottom is. And I always tell the mums just to resist the temptation to drop your arms down um, once the baby's placed in there because they're quite heavy and everyone does that and then you sort of like this in the photo. So just make sure they hold their hands up really nice and high, just like that. So we're just going to place them there. So when I'm working with the baby and I'm about to put it into your parents' arms, I've always got it just the same way it's lying. So not upside down or we don't have to move the baby around too much. And I tuck its legs up while I'm working with it just like this and its hands over, so it's a very minimal movement once it's in one of those arms. So just like that, and then I'll just reach under, support the baby's head, and make sure I scoop up and under, and I'm supporting the arms and the legs, and I just let the towel drop to the ground to mark. Now, you want the baby's head facing out a little bit, so if you can do that when you're placing them, it's a good idea. If you can't manage that, it's okay, you can always adjust later. So I usually have the baby just like this. I'm gently rocking sometimes, it's nice and warm in the room, and the baby's usually sound asleep. And just lift up, place the bottom in that hand, and the head into this hand. Now, the things to watch with this pose is making sure that this thumb is up against the hand and nice and relaxed, just like that, and that the mum is up and the feet are covering anything that might show over there if the baby is naked. So, and then I have the fingers from the back hand coming over so that you can see there's the little fingers there, and the little toes, you can see the toes there. So the baby is facing towards the light, so I just angle mum a little bit so that lovely light comes down and hits the baby's face. And then you just say to mum, just bring your cheek out and down. So you almost feel like you're turtlenecking, you feel a little bit awkward when you're doing it, but it looks great in photos. So out and down over the baby, just like that. That's perfect. That's gorgeous. And then if you can just lean in and just sniff the baby's temple, just like that, beautiful. Just bring your face around slightly more towards me. That way and then down again. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. And then you can give baby a kiss if you want, but just don't purse your lips, just rest them gently against the Beautiful, beautiful. The other one I often transition to straight after this one, just because it's nice and easy, is um, a shot like this, so you get both mum's profile and baby's profile. So all you need to do is just turn and then bring it down so that you're holding the bottom like that and you can just like that. So with this one, you need to bring the baby's face much closer to mom's face than you ever would normally. So I basically say touch your noses together and then go out just a tiny little bit. So you just bring it up nice and close so they touch the noses and then you come out just a tiny, not even that much. Yeah, that's really good.